Well, how do there, chums? We've got some news for you today, people. Got myself a lovely cup of tea. And when I say I've got some news, I did a video the other day wondering whether the Quicksilver items would come into store inside of No Man's Sky. Huh. This game right here. Let's jump over into that game, shall we, people? Chicka pop out, chicka boom boom. And let's head on over to the kiosk. Because look, the bar has actually reset. If you're wondering what I mean by the bar, it's this thing here, this little see-through bar. And you can see that it's got a little faint blue line there. That means we've started unlocking something new inside of the Quicksilver store, people inside of your verse. I guess we have. Right it. So let's uh, head on over to the old Quicksilver merchant, Johnny Five as I call him, because he looks a little bit like the guy out of Short Circuit. Let's see if I can sneak in through the side here, which, yeah, managed to. Lovely jubbly. And let's see what he's got inside of the Quicksilver store. This is where you can also collect your Quicksilver items and Expedition items. But anyway, let's go into here. And yes, there's three new things. We've got the Blue System Decal. We've got the Gladio Tempeticological Decal. Yeah, the Beetle one. And we've also got the Fluttering Decal. Freaking lovely jubbly, hey? Yeah, so three different decals. Now, these ones are probably used by my wonder projectors. If I've got these in my wonders, that'd be pretty darn cool. The blue system one, maybe if I've got a base in a blue system, could stick it on the freaking wall. Don't know. I don't know whether I'd ever use that one. It might look good as a tablecloth or a doormat, though, mightn't it? You could find a use for it, I'm sure. But there we go. So they're all 400 quicksilver each. Usually if it's about 200 quicksilver, I say about a day and a half for 200 quicksilver. So 400 quicksilver, what's that? Three days roughly. So each of these is going to take three days. Three, six, nine. I think about nine days and we should have all of these. Okay? All right, people. Sometimes they go a little bit quicker over the weekend, though. So I, if there is a weekend in between that, I do speed that up a little bit. So I might reduce that to seven in my old estimates, you know. But anyway, there we go, pips. Um, Yeah. We've got some decals that we can unlock now. So hopefully you can get your Quicksilvers. You can see here I've got quite a lot of Quicksilver already. But to run Quicksilver missions, you hit up this cube over here. And it's usually the top mission inside of here. So right now I could do Eliminate Hazardous Flora, earn myself 400 Quicksilver. That's going to earn one of those decals. And you can see here I've got three stacked. It stacks up to three so yeah, you can leave them for a couple of days and then come in and do all three back to back if you wanted and get yourself 400 Quicksilver a throw. That'd be 1,200 Quicksilver. Yeah, go on. Mass this, uh, this uh, time of the morning. Never a strong point. Ooh, okay. Anyway, what comes next after those decals? Well, I know what comes next after those decals because I myself have got the No Man's Sky Assistant app. So here we go. I've got my phone in my hand. That's the No Man's Sky Assistant app icon right there. Boom. There's the No Man's Sky Assistant app. And then if I just go into Community Mission, and I can see the rewards right here. They're all right there on the screen. But if I go to Next Community Reward, you can see here there's ice statues. Ice statues. So we've got this one to go. That one's going to come next. And then after that, we've got a Diplo Ice statue. Thank you, Diplo Ice statue. And after that one, we have got a ship ice statue. All three of these will appear at the same time after those decals. And then there's another set of decals after that. Very similar to the ones that we're getting now. So yeah, there we go, people. That's your kind of No Man's Sky news. So yeah, hopefully you enjoyed that, people, inside the view of us. And that... Uh, I've got Dragon's Dogma coming to my channel. On the 22nd of March, Dragon's Dogma 2 will be coming to my channel. And if you haven't heard of Dragon's Dogma before, it's a Capcom game. It's it's very cool. Very, very awesome. Greek mythos. Think Simbad. Think, um, you know, Clash of Titans and all that good stuff from the 80s. Those stop frame animation like movies. That in a video game. That's about the best that I can describe it, people inside the view of us. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. Until next time, goodbye, goodbye. Goodbye again, I guess.